Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Gold version. Uh, in this episode we are going to go through Ice Path. I don't really need the bike in here. Uh, because this place is going to be full of ice puzzles. And random battles, apparently. Hey look, a Zubat! <laughs> I cut out most of my trainer battles, but I keep in this this uh, random fight with Zubat in a cave. Oh, I haven't healed up Seed yet. You know, uh, it's probably not a good idea to keep Seed out front, but whatever. I'll just do it for the lols. Oh boy, what do we have now? Ooh, aren't you a cutie? I like you. I'm gonna have you snort this. <laughs> Yes, yeah, see a cute animal, have smort, snort some powder. Ooh, but I like you. I am going to throw an Ultra Ball at you. Yes, I found an Ultra Ball in the last route. Deal with it. Come on, little cutie. Come on. Come on. You know. Yay! I caught me a swine up. That's right, I just caught me the sixth member of my team. Swine up! Swine up, the pig Pokemon. It rubs its snout on the ground to find and dig up food. It sometimes discovers hot springs. Give a nickname to Swine up. I am going to nickname this cute little guy Fuzzy Wuzzy. Oh wait, cute little girl. <laughs> I had noticed that. Okay, so now Fuzzy Wuzzy, the second female Pokemon on my team. Fuzzy Wuzzy was a swine up. Anyways, end. Now let's treat that little poison I gave you. Sorry, but I needed to inflict a status element on you. And you are an ice ground type, so I couldn't rightfully use uh, use uh, Bolt to paralyze you. And give you a super potion, you which you do not need. I'll give Seed that, that super potion. Alright, I'm not really going to be using Fuzzy Wuzzy in here, but I am going to teach her a TM, because she doesn't have any good moves right now. Icy Wind. It's... I'm pretty sure she knows Powdered Snow, so Moonpie can learn Ice... Oh, you you never cease to amaze me, Moonpie. Alright, Fuzzy Wuzzy learned Icy Wind. Apparently you didn't even know four moves. Uh, so let's take a look at Fuzzy Wuzzy. Stats. This is probably not the greatest idea for a Pokemon, but you know me and my ground types. I love me some good ground type. Probably should have uh, looked for a Jinx as uh, my Pokemon. Anyways, this thing knows Tackle, Powdered Snow, Endure, and Icy Wind. Pretty much the only good move it knows is the move I just taught it. Um, Attack 28, Defense 28, Special Attack 23, Special Defense 23, Speed 33. It's also um, moves ice or type ice and ground. So yeah, that's Fuzzy Wuzzy in a nutshell. Um, I'm really not going to be like training her in this episode, but I'll, I'll probably just do a bunch of training off screen. Anyways, going to use this repel. As long as Fuzzy Wuzzy isn't the first in my team, I shouldn't run into any more Swineups or Golbats or whatever or what have you. All right, so. Uh, here we come to our first actually difficult ice puzzle. Let's see if I can remember to do this right. Okay, so as you can see, uh, we've got a lot of elements here. We need to get through there. There's only about two squares that we can actually go through. Now, if you look around here, uh, if we are able to stop ourselves in one of these rocks over here... Oh, I guess this counts as steps. One of these st uh, rocks here, we'll be able to make it through here. Now, I believe the actual solution to this puzzle is along the lines of this here. Let's see. Oh, no, wait. This way. Oh, I think I screwed something up. Okay, wait. Let me try that again. I think I was close, but, well, no cigar. Um, this way? No, not that way. 
Uh, hum, oh hum. I'm getting close. I, I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. But well, um, because <laughs> I've solved this before. I did have a practice file where I made it through here. Um. Okay, now down there, here, 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 and there we go. That's how it is done, right there. That's how you make it through that. <laughs> this music will, like, it'll get in your head, and it'll just be so vexing. It'll be what you think of, uh, about this cave. Alright, uh, this puzzle really isn't that difficult, but it's just to get an item. You just have to go around and do that. But, that's a quite useful item, considering it's an HM that's required to beat the game. It's actually Waterfall, a move that allows you to climb up waterfalls, but I believe you do need the 8th Gym Badge to use it. <coughs> it's not as good as Surf, so... Eh. Um, so, uh, we'll just move along. Now, here is a half-ice, half-strength puzzle. There's ice below us if we go down these, uh these little openings in the floor, but we actually need to use, uh, we actually have to use these, um, rocks. Uh, so we need to move these rocks into the correct positions, and then drop them down all four of these holes. I'll just put this rock over here for now. We'll move that later. Um, but you have to map these out before you actually, uh, attempt to do anything with them. So, uh, let's see. Okay, I think I know what I'm doing here. Hopefully. Hope I don't screw myself. Alright, now down under here. Push that. And... Down the hatch. There we go. The boulder fell through. Yeah, you need to do all four boulders or you cannot solve the ice puzzle underneath. But, well, this is more of a strength puzzle. Because, uh, after you complete the strength puzzle... The ice puzzle is stupidly easy, so there is that. Alright, so go down through here. And, ah, uh, stupid cheap repels. I need some better ones. Because these things wear off like mad, I swear. But, it's not too bad just to spray on a little bit more axe and then just keep going. Alright, that's three of the four boulders. Uh, this one I just push up here, and, uh, let's see, here, and there we go. Wait, was that three? No, two. I think this is three. Uh, making this last one here four. See why I push it there? Because I needed it to be there so I could come through there. Alright, see? Understanding. Now, now I need to jump down one of these holes, and see there's these rocks down here. I can walk along the edges, uh, collect some items. There's a max potion there. It's nice. It'll heal 100% uh, of your Pokemon's uh, HP. We d but we need to get to that uh, ladder in the middle. That is our main goal and our repel for off. And uh, if you fall down here before you complete the uh, strength puzzle, you can just come back up through that. All right, so we just need to hook ourselves on one of these here rocks. And then we can just make it across all four of these rocks, and boom! Bada bing, bada boom, there we go. Full heal as our reward, uh, as well as progressing the, through the cave. Uh, there, uh, right there is a uh, rock that you can use Rock Smash on to get that item. I don't know what it is, because I never really did that. Because Rock Smash is really not that great of a move. You don't really need it to complete the game. And, just, man. Alright, so, uh, here's another ice puzzle, but it's really not all that difficult, although you cannot enter it from that side. I did that just to show you, I didn't screw up at all. Alright, but this is quite interesting, because it's got a little, like, island in the middle. And, well, it's not really a puzzle at all now, is it? Um, I want to get that item, but how do I do stuff? So ah, whatever. I'll just make it through before I waste any more steps. I think I've got a, a super repel or two in my bag, so it shouldn't be too difficult to make it through. 
Alright, you can just come down here for this item, which is iron. I believe that will raise the defense of a Pokemon. Um, so I would like to give that to Moon Pie. Yep, Moon Pie. Just so we can take a little bit more punishment. It's only by, like, one, so it's not going to be, like, super helpful, but... Well, it's something. And it'll re... Oh, I probably should have given that to Knight. Now that I think about it, it'll raise friendship. Because giving vitamins does uh, raise friendship. Wait, no, um... There's this PP up, which uh, I think I'll hold on to that and save that for a rainy day. Alright, Repel War off. Hopefully I won't run into too many wild Pokemon, or none at all. And making it through the Ice Path is as simple as that. Now let's see where, where the hell we are. Oh, hello. Uh, where the hell are we? Wow, you came through the Ice Path? You must be a real hotshot trainer. <laughs> I know, I know. You don't be too impressed, Miss Green Hair. Alright, so now here we are in Blackthorn City. A quiet mountain retreat, but also the home of the eighth and final gym leader. So I think I'll be I think I'll do a little bit of training with Fuzzy Wuzzy off the off screen. Um so so, um, I'm uh, probably going to need to go find myself an Everstone. I think Professor Elm has one. I'll need to do a little bit of research. Anyways, um, I guess in the next episode, I'll have trained up Fuzzy Wuzzy and we can take on the gym. So, this is me, Thrasho2, saying be cool, save often, and don't do anything I wouldn't.